Hey Leo Collective, what's up y'all? Welcome to the channel. Welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me. I do appreciate you guys so very much. All right, let's get into this Collective Leo reading. Only take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Flip the rose if you need to. Could it be past, present, or future energy or someone else around you I'm picking up on? Immediately, y'all, I don't know why this song came through. I have not been channeling music all day, but when I get to you, I'm hearing... Money, power, respect, which mean life. Money, power, respect, you be eating right. You'll see the light. What's the key to life? <laughs> money, power, respect. I heard money, power, respect in my head. And I'm going to tell y'all what I get from that, even though I don't know if this is what they were, their intentions were when they made that song. There's a sense of jealousy. We have envy here. There's a sense of jealousy because of your money, the power that you've garnered. The success that you've garnered something about your status really some it really has somebody fascinated or the fact that you are so fascinating and you're so self-sufficient i'm i'm getting ahead because i got all these thoughts coming to me i look down and i see pioneer groundbreaking pathfinder trailblazer creator yes leo yes this is what i feel like they are. i feel like somebody feels like they kind of like are in your shadow they real they 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 love you they admire you they know that you shit, right but they have a problem with it okay your first card overall energy is amusement park this is thrilling rides carnival fun and festive atmosphere see i'm just i'm, I'm telling y'all right now there's something about your carefree vibrant energy look at the color of this card vibrant energy and i always get fire sign energy whenever i pull this card so it's interesting that that will come out for you look at this somebody in your energy is codependent i will support and rely on myself they want to be you they want to be able to recreate what you've created in your life okay now this could be family this could be a friend this could be a co-worker this could be a love interest somebody from your past it could be anybody okay your mom or daddy your dog it could be anybody what you don't see coming towards you is fearlessness. I expand my comfort zone. See, this is the thing. One thing I know about a Leo, a Leo sets their mind to something, they do it. Just as simple as that. You're a fixed sign just like me. And we are determined. We're stubborn. We don't give in easily. And this is the thing about you. Somebody is like watching you and they're seeing how you have taken like, no matter what's coming your way in life, you've been able to do something with it. Build something from it. Never let it stop you. And they want to pull that from you. They, they're codependent on your energy. They want to pull that from you. Not so much that they don't want you to have it, but more so like they want to have it too. That's why we have envy, not jealousy. Envy is when you want what someone else has, but you don't want to take away whatever they have. We have my qualities are beyond compare. See, look, nobody can compare to you. <laughs> and you have that confidence and they know it. What's going on in your emotions? We have disco ball, free spirit, pleasure, and amusement, an abrupt ending to your fun. Hmm. So we're going to look into that. And then we also have fascinated. I thoroughly explore my interests. I'm telling you, somebody is really inspired by you. You are a pioneer. It's no coincidence. Whenever I look down in that car, it has something to do with the energy I pick up on. I don't see. I never see anything as a coincidence. I don't believe in coincidence. So let's see what's going on here. Mix these cards up. If it comes out again, it'll tell you everything you need to know. Show me codependent. Who's codependent on Leo? Oh, God. Somebody with STI, STD. Now, I've been telling y'all for months now, y'all. Some of y'all been dealing with somebody that's been spreading something around. So whoever this person is, it could have been a love interest. Or somebody that you know who's maybe promiscuous and maybe they have something and you're aware of it. So that could be a family member or a friend. This person is a control freak. <laughs> I'm telling you, they want what you have so bad. What's fearless coming towards you? We have more. You're getting even more. There's growth. There's expansion here for you. Ooh, wee. Spa day and massage. So not only more work, but more play, more amusement park days, more downtime, more vacations, more thrills, more. It's like a fun ride. You're on a thrilling ride right now. You're just riding your wave right now. Show me um, envious, one track mind. Somebody preoccupied with thinking about you. It says preoccupied thoughts on one thing or person. This person is obsessed with you. Jesus Christ, you're all they think about from the moment they wake up to the minute they go to sleep and then you're in their dreams too. Prepared. See, if they would prepare themselves and be prepared like you, they wouldn't have to envy you. They could just do what they needed to do for themselves. You know what I'm saying? So show me um, disco ball. I can't stand people that's going around feeling jealous. 
we have body transformation. Somebody could be getting some plastic surgery, some work done, or just transforming their body the way they're eating, taking care of themselves better. Because this says free spirit, pleasure, and amusement. Wow, with the amusing part. I didn't even realize that. Oh, yeah. Some of y'all might be getting a kick out of this person. You know they, they are like on your heels. We have home. This could be somebody in your home. We have a destination wedding. You're headed for marriage or commitment. Destined for marriage. What's done in the dark is always exposed in the light. Some of you are about to see this person for who they are. Taking things one step at a time. No rush. This is temperance. Rolling with the punches. Didn't I tell you all that? You got wealth and abundance here. Some of you about to ban this person on social media. We got shadow ban. They're trying to mirror you. Mm -hmm. Most people quit before the breakthrough. But what did I tell you at the very beginning? Some of y'all can have a Sagittarius placement or be dealing with one. This is that feeling that I talked about before of like not giving up no matter what comes your way. Even if you struggle. Somebody is overindulging here. Maybe this is what the body transformation is. Somebody's trying to get, that could be you, scaling back on. Some of y'all could be looking good. Scaling back on like poor eating habits and looking really good. You're taking care of home right now. You're manifesting here with a lot of attraction. The old way won't bring new results. It's time for a new beginning, a leap of faith, risk it all. Yeah, you're thoroughly exploring your options. Look at this catfish. Somebody want to be you so bad. They want to be you so bad. But this cycle is closing because you are burned out. Some of y'all, this is a Sagittarius. Somebody took your kindness for weakness. You got a good heart. Spirit is telling you to sit this out, reject the offer, liberate yourself. And there is a false prophet we have restart. Hmm. So this person around you, maybe you think that they have it going on more than they actually do. They could talk a good game. They could talk a good game with false pro profit being in. Show me STD, codependent, and control free. What in the world is this? Page of Swords. We have Libra Aquarius, so Gemini who's younger than you. This person is studying you. They're very strategic. They're very cunning. Control freak is the three of swords. This person is breaking their own heart. <laughs> They're watching you. And it's like the more they watch you, they don't get inspired as much as they get jealous. They, they hurt their own feelings. Some of you have cut this person off. Could be a Libra, a Christ, or a Gemini. They could be younger, don't have to be. Hmm. Show me fearless. Five of Pentacles. See, some of y'all have been through a lot here. You might be like um, the black sheep of your family. I always see that card as the black sheep of the family. That's Taurus energy. And then we have the Ace of Swords. But see, you overcome. This is your breakthrough. You're very intelligent. Some of you have also realized that the truth of the matter is you needed to release this person. You needed to ice them out, abandon them, leave them out in the cold. You have a, a Libra Christ or Gemini or Taurus here. Well, some of you can have Libra Christ, Gemini placements and cut off a Taurus. I don't know. Show me this person obsessed with you. Knight of Swords. Oh, this person has been in and out of your life. Y'all could have had an on again, off again, friendship, relationship, whatever. Could be a Gemini. Show me prepared. Two of Pentacles. <coughs> You're really good at multitasking. We have Capricorn and Gemini there. May the first could be significant. The third, the fifth, the first, or the second of the month could be significant. Maybe that's when you were born in um, Leo season. We have the four of wands coming out with home. There's a new home. Some of you could be moving. I heard dream home just now could be happening in Aquarius season. Cancer got a lot of good news coming in Aquarius season. So some, I mean, in um, Aries season. So some of you could be on the Cancer Leo cusp. What's body transformation? Because this is literally like a twin flame coming in. Like this is in your emotions. You could be moving with someone, marrying someone. This is a twin flame in Aries for some of you. Oh my God, Aries again with the Emperor. This is your divine masculine coming in. Oh my God. Wow. This person is a boss. This person is a boss. This could also be some of you elevating in your career and meeting your match. We have fascinated with the Ace of Wands and the Death card. I feel like there's somebody who's going to change their play of ways for you because this is the person you're destined to be with. A Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, a Taurus, an Aries, or a Sagittarius. Those are your messages. We'll see you all next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.